Are you and your family constantly tormented by brain-hungry robots? Well, Spy Cake Corporation has something for you. A ballistic missile complete with a bathroom and bedroom for all your needs for escaping the robot invasion. May cause radiation sickness and death. Hello guys, my name is Spy and welcome back to some more Scrap Mechanic. Now, last time we played, we fooled around with the horns and made a crappy little piano and a prototype alarm system, which worked alright, I guess. Could be better. Now, what I got here is I got the base of a bigger, more badass rocket ship. Um, now, if you didn't see my first video, we built a pretty crappy rocket that actually had quite a bit of problems. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to get give it a little more aesthetic design. Okay, here we go. And I think we can possibly go to the very top. don't want to go all the way. There we go. Now I'm going to do that to the other sides. And then it should be good to go. Okay, we're nearly done. The aesthetic designs on the outside. And I built this little tiny lift here. Pretty basic. To get me up the lift a little easier. Hey, okay, I think that looks good. Missed a little spot here. Okay, so one of the things I did with this rocket is I actually made it hollow due to it being super heavy if it is totally made of wood. So we're going to close this up. Don't really need to go in there. I was going to add a seat in there, but it kind of disturbs your view. Yep. Now we need to add the rockets or the thrusters to it to get it to properly lift. Now I don't know how many we can fit on here. We probably fit about four on each side, plus some in the middle. Maybe. We need a lot of lift to get us up into space. I don't think there's actually space. I haven't been up there yet, but we can do our best. Okay, we have enough rockets. I think you can tell I like rockets. Maybe. I don't know. You guys think I like rockets? Does it look like I like rockets? I don't know. So, I think that's enough thrusters. Now we should maybe add our seat. Alright, now that we got the rockets set up, it should work. I'm not going to doubt myself, but knowing me, I messed up with something. So here we go. What we're going to do is we're going to add a little tiny bunk to this rocket ship. Now I don't know if this is a good idea, but who knows? You always need a little cabin in your rocket. So I don't know. So I'm going to add a little door here. I don't know if it's going to mess with our rocket while it's flying. It might. Who knows though. Okay, there we go. Guess we can add a little button there. If I can find them. There we go. Now we need a controller. We're going to put the controller somewhere even so it does not mess with the weight distribution. Okay, that looks good. We're going to hook the hinge on to the controller. And this is going to go here. Okay, that looks good. Now we need to make the door openable, so we need to go 90 degrees blue. And it should work pretty good. Let's test this out. Looks good, looks good. So we got a working door on our rocket ship. Now what we gotta do is we have to add bed. A bed to the rocket ship. Because when you land on the planet, or you're in space, you want a bed to sleep on. So we got to find the mattress here. They added the mattresses a few updates ago, I believe, when they added the horns. So it's most likely that your rocket's not going to be standing vertical when you land on a planet. So what we're going to do is we're going to add it lifted right here. And we can't really sit on it ourselves until we land. But that looks pretty good. And then we also need to add... A sink because 
you know, spaceships have working water. I think that looks good. And you also need a toilet. So where are the toilets? There's a toilet. So you can actually sit on this toilet and it will actually flush. Okay. I think that's good. That looks decent. So now we have a little tiny home in our rocket ship. I doubt this door will actually work when we land, but who knows. So there we go. Let's test this out and see if it works. Now, I might want to turn up the thrusters. Let's turn up the thrusters on the sides at least. Okay, that looks like it's good. I turned up the thrusters. Let's test this out. Whoa! Holy crap! <laughs> this is awesome. Well, we hit the top of the world. And we're still going. There we go. Our rocket is functional. It's a little back heavy though, but I think it's fine. It does what it needs to do. And now let's land this thing. Land this thing in the most fashionable way possible. By falling. Now, there's no proper way to land this, but I think we could do it. Awesome. We, we stuck the landing. Now, the problem is our door's on the other side. Okay, there we go. I didn't think the door thing out very well. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now, let's try opening this. Sometimes you got to... Push your way in. We can actually go inside. And there we go. We have a bathroom and a bed. That's pretty much it. I don't think a rocket ship needs much more than that. So there we go. There's our rocket ship. Now I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you have suggestions for me to build anything in later episodes, let me know. This is a pretty easy build. And thank you all for watching and subscribing, and I hope to see you guys next episode. Stay sweet! Bye!